Welcome everyone, this is Robert Lee with Testo and we're going to answer a few questions today on the 320, uh, 310, 320, or not the 310, the 320 and the 330 um, applies to both of them. So first question is that I get is when I save something to the clipboard, can I take it from the clipboard and put it in a, in a folder or in a measurement site? The answer is no. The clipboard is for printing. That's all it's for. You can't copy and paste it. Uh, from the clipboard to a folder or a measurement site like you can on your computer. Clipboards for printing, that's all it's for. So, the next question is, well then how do I get it to a site, a measurement site? When you get your 320, you'll notice that there's a folder slash site up here at the top. That tells you where you are. That's, that's kind of like your navigation menu, your breadcrumbs um, on your web browser and your, your uh, Windows Explorer table. So what we're going to do, first thing is we're going to go to folders locations and you can see I already have a couple of different folders in here but we're just going to go down here and make a new one. So we're going to hit options, new measurement, we need a uh, new folder. So we go down here to new folder, we hit OK, folder name, we hit edit and we're going to make this one um, five, six, seven. So after you've named it, you go down here, you have to highlight this last row where it says save so that it m turns this button to save. And then hit save. Same thing for contact person street post code, you, you put all that in. And then the next thing we're going to do is we're going to go down to that folder we just made, 567, and we're going to hit options again, and we're going to put in a new measurement site. So our new measurement site is going to be called... Um, e, F, G, and again, toggle down to where it says save, hit, close, combustion type, we're going to hit this, so you can set up combustion types, so the first combustion type would, would be, say, a 90% condensing furnace. The second one would be a 95% condensing. The third one would be induced draft. The fourth one would be um, natural draft. And it only goes to four. So you could pick that there. And that matters in the matrix, which we'll talk about at another time. But that's where the, the combustion type really comes in uh, to play there. Um, go down altitude, hit edit. We're going to put our altitude in 725 feet. That's my altitude. Save. Bam. So now you have created a folder, 567, with the measurement place named EFG. So naming conventions are your own, but a folder could be a building number, for example, building number one, and then each measurement, measurement site inside of it can be boiler number one with the serial number, uh, furnace number one, water heater number, whatever. But you can put as many sites under there as you, as you need to in each folder. Um, if you're a service company, maybe the folder is the service uh, tech number or van number. Um, anyway, that you can arrange it however you want. But you basically have a folder and then a bunch of sites under it is, is how it works. Um, okay, so we're in the folders EFG. So we just named the folder 567 and our measurement site EFG. We're going to hit OK and that takes us straight to our measurement options. So as soon as you hit OK in measurement options, you go. You have to go pick a test that you want to do. Um, the test that we're going to do today is gas clocking. And the reason we're going to do that is because that's the next question on the list. However, in an effort to keep the video short and able to view them on phones very easily, it's going to be another video. So that concludes the can I copy from the clipboard which is no it's only for printing and how to set up a folder site question hope it helped watch out for the next video this is Robert Lee with Testo